Hello friends, today we are going to look at the story Creative Writing. So let's begin. Good afternoon children. Today we are going to write Creative Writing. So let's see our hands and minds at work. So children, now let me give you your topic. Describe your favorite pet. Be creative. Start with your work right now. Everyone starts to write. Then the teacher says, Children, some of you may not be having a pet. So, just build your pet with your own creativity of imagination. The bell rang. Ding, 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 ding. The class period ended. The teacher said, We will stop here. Do it as your homework and submit it tomorrow. Take your own time. Next day, the children submitted their work. They thought that ma'am would appreciate them a lot and make their friends jealous about them. But most of the children were shocked to see that they wrote the exact same lines and the exact same thing. Do you know how it is possible? Most of the children searched in net and wrote it in their notebook. The teacher praised few children who wrote on their own. Children, do you know the meaning of creative writing? It is to build something with your own imagination. I agree you need few information from the net, but it's not right to simply copy from the net. Children who copy it from the net should redo it and submit by tomorrow. So friends, now we came to the end of the story. Let me tell you the moral of the story. Don't simply copy and write from net. Self-thinking is good. Mistakes can be corrected. Quiz time. What is the topic given by the teacher? Answer A. Describe your favorite dog. Answer B. Describe your favorite pet. Answer C. Describe your favorite season. Question number 2. Why many children wrote the same thing? Answer A. Because they copied from the net. Answer C. Because they self-taught and wrote. Thank you for watching. Share and subscribe. Bye.